Okay, we're still working on the nose and I'm going to bring down his face a little bit here just to round this off. I'm going to re define where his nose is stuff he has here. Okay. Like I said, you can either give it eyes or you don't have to. It's really up to you. I'm going to give him some hair here in a second. But I'm also going to give him a little bit of a halo. My version of a halo. Alright. I just want to kind of put two there. Yeah, I try to, um, okay. and with the halo all I do is do a stop cut going across like a big deep V cut all right and we're gonna come up this way and same thing another V cut and the V cut is just a matter of holding your knife a little bit at an angle and then coming back at another like a V cut here there we go We're gonna we're gonna bring this down a little bit and recede that little halo a little bit. Now we're gonna come down. We're just gonna bring this down a little bit. I'm sorry. We're just gonna take that off and we're gonna redo it again here. I'm just trying to make it a little bit lower than the hair that's sitting in the hair a little bit. See how we have that? We just want that kind of poofy in the front. Poofy hair in the front. There we go. Yeah, that's what I was looking to do. this down a little bit. Redefine that again. Sorry guys, I'm taking a little bit longer to figure out how to do this hair. Let me just do it back here for a second. Alright. Alright, that's better. So what I did was I reseeded that a little bit and then took rounded off the back portion of his hair a little bit better. All right. All right. So that's where we're at right now with this. Yeah, we're gonna come up here and make a little bit deeper where the nose. And the hairline meat. That, that makes that nose stick out much further. See that? All right, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to put his mouth in. Let's get all this rough stuff off his face. All right. I'm going to bring this down just a little bit. Yeah, so, okay. Just a little further. I don't know. There we go. Alright, now we're going to put 
little line here from the nose down. All right, just like so. And we're going to have him smiling because he's going to be a smiley, friendly. So, put a little stop cut there. Having a little V cut. And we're going to put a little V cut right here. Just a matter. There we go. this side and now we have his mouth going across right and we're just gonna turn it upward that's it a little V cut there now you can use a parting tool I, I always like doing it with a knife instead of a parting tool all right so there's our little smiley angel all right and we can bring this down a little bit. Now his hair is going to have to go in there. Whoopsie. I just did something to his hairline there. That's not good. You got to remember you're working on the end of his, and uh, the end of, of the block. So you have to be a little bit careful. I'm going to dig this down a little further and just make this a little bit deeper. Well, if you ever want things to look, have some depth to it, all you do is do your little cuts and re 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 cut it out right on those lines and things will look deeper, look nicer and crisp when you're done. You know. Okay. So if you do want to put an eye in, all you have to do is put a little loop here. You can do a little loop like this and just put an eye in on either side if you want. That's up to you. Um It is really up to you on how you want to do that. I'm just going to trim this down just a little bit. Alright. We're going to put hair in there in just a second. Now, the other thing you want to do with, with this is you want to kind of put where his wings are. Just like there's there's actual wings here, so I'll show you how I did that. All you want to do is take your knife and you want to do a V-cut. And at the end there, you just want to cut it out just a little bit to give it a little bit of a, a loop there, like they're separated.